Good day, welcome to the Gulf News Update for Wednesday, February the 25th. Here are the top stories at this hour. Inquiries on home contents insurance to cover emergencies such as fires have surged over the past few days following the Torch Tower fire in Dubai Marina on Saturday. But the spike is likely to wane over time as many residents seem unaware of the importance of having personal belongings insured in the UAE, according to insurers. Out of 676 apartments at the Torch Tower, 101 units have been closed indefinitely. Shayman Anwar became the first UAE player to score a century in a Cricket World Cup match as he passed three figures during the team's Pool B match against Ireland today. The middle order batsman scored 106 off 83 balls to help the UAE post 278 for nine from their 50 overs after being put in to bat first in Brisbane. Qatar is committed to defeating Daesh. Its Amir Sheikh Tamim bin Hamad Al Thani assured US President Barack Obama in his first official visit to the White House. Obama said Sheikh Tamim was committed to fighting extremists and supporting the moderate opposition in Syria. A former Marine was sentenced to life in prison without parole after being convicted of murdering the US Navy SEAL, whose story inspired the blockbuster movie American Sniper. Jurors unanimously rejected claims from 27-year-old Eddie Ray Ruth that he was not guilty on grounds of insanity when he killed sniper Chris Kyle and his friend Chad Littlefield at a Texas shooting range in February 2013. Footballer Luis Suarez scored a double on his return to England for the first time since a move last summer as Barcelona secured a 2-1 win over Manchester City. The Uruguayan struck twice in the first half to give his side the upper hand in their Champions League last 16 first leg clash. The other tie of the night saw Juventus beat Borussia Dortmund 2-1 in Turin. Daniel Craig has been taking advantage of new James Bond movie Spectre being shot in Rome to sample the local cuisine in between high-speed car chases around the Eternal City. The famously super-toned 007 star has reportedly been spotted in a number of the local eateries. And finally, the weather. Today's high across the UAE will be 24 degrees Celsius, dropping to 18 tonight. That's all for now. Thanks for watching. And as always, you can get the latest news on gulfnews.com.